How about, do you like pink? Mm -hmm. Ooh, would this be a good one? Or do you want to pick one? Do you, or there's white, or there's, this is kind of like a purpley color up here. Mm -hmm. It's going to be for our ant. What I've always wanted to do is really just incorporate lots of texture and lots of different varieties. When you get a bouquet for me, it's one of a kind. Um, I don't ever have a recipe. I just get fresh flowers in a couple times a week, and I make something up fresh, unique. Uh, big variety, feathers, willows, anything that's in season, and um, it always just makes it really one of a kind. Pretty much for any holiday, we like to bring in a couple little different things, um, specific to, you know, Valentine's Day. Today we're having a pop-up with Ruby in the Wild, Jody Archibald's flower shop. And Valentine's Day is so known for roses, and I love that, but what I brought up today at Paper Cranes was such a fun variety of chamomile and wax flower and hypericum berry. I just want it to be not just about the rose, but what rose I love to use for Valentine's Day is a specialty rose called a heart rose. And so it just has beautiful ruffle and again that texture that I love that sets it apart from just a traditional um, plain rose. Thank you. You guys are the sweetest little girls. Ruby in the Wild has been in business here in Butte for about what a year one, and a half. What one do you and think would be fun? so lucky to do celebrations of life, um, events large and small, of course weddings, and then everyday flowers, um, pop-up shops, and flowers at the farmer's market in the summer. Beautiful flowers. Thank you. 